single women, I'm starting a series for you. God didn't make me 39 and single for no reason, so I'm just going to help other people. The first topic I want to talk about is there's nothing wrong with you. Society makes you believe that something is wrong with you if you're single, specifically women. Your family asks you when you get married, have you met anybody, even friends, even close friends. It's always one of the first topics, and I don't know why it gets on my nerves that that is always a top priority topic. So we're always feeling this weight of like, oh yeah, I'm, I'm still single, like, <laughs> And subconsciously, it kind of makes you think like, well, is something wrong with me? Like everybody keeps asking and I'm still not married. No, just no, nothing is wrong with you. So don't even listen to those people. Like, oh, you must be too picky. You must not get out enough, blah, blah, blah. Tell them to be quiet. You're gonna do you. Half these people out here are just letting anybody and everybody into their world. Like, no, we have, we have boundaries. We have expectations. We have standards. When God created Adam, it was Adam that was missing something, so God created Eve. Devon Franklin one time in a sermon said that Eve, when she was created, she didn't come up and say, where's my man? He said she envisioned her saying, you rang? <laughs> so just remember, like, ladies, God didn't create us first and be like, we were missing something. He created man first and said they were missing something. So today, I want you to just walk around and believe that you're God's best and have the confidence and just ignore those people that say something's wrong with you.